Now, it's time for my What the Farage moments. Those stories that I see that make me really, make my hair stand up on end. And one of them, I don't want to scare you, but we have all been told, haven't we, that the vaccine was the saviour. Provided we had the vaccine, life could go on as normal, nothing to worry about. Well, let's take Gibraltar, which of course was part of the South West region when we were members of the European Union. Gibraltar has arguably the highest vaccine rate of any country in the world. They've pretty much all been double vaxxed on Gibraltar. And yet, there is now a spike in infections in Gibraltar. Uh, Covid cases in Gibraltar are certainly three times, perhaps even nearly four times, what they are in the United Kingdom. And the Gibraltarian government have decided that Christmas is cancelled. So you see, I'm not, you know, I'm not saying the vaccine doesn't have benefits. And I do think the evidence is clear that if you've had the vaccine, you are far less likely to get seriously ill, far less likely to be hospitalised, and far less likely to die. But I'm beginning to feel that we've been sold a bit of a pup in believing, just by getting double jabbed, that life could continue as normal. The Gibraltarians have lost Christmas. I hope and pray passionately that Boris doesn't take away Christmas from us again this year. But I do worry with the National Health Service that already has got a waiting list of almost six million people. And with colds and flu now much more rife than they were this time last year, I am fearful that something unpleasant could happen over the course of the next few weeks.